Hey, what's up guys? Ali here from iSocialU.com and welcome back to my channel. Guess what? You can post to your Facebook pages stories from desktop without using any tools. Before we jump into the video and see how to do it, you know what to do. Subscribe, hit the bell icon and also like this video. All right, now let's jump right into this. So basically your Facebook pages and the stories you can post from your desktop without using any tool. You don't need any third party tools. You will use a tool that Facebook has, Facebook has created, it's called Creator Studio. So let's look at that process step by step. So first of all, if you have not signed up for Facebook Creator Studio, do that right now. Pause this video and then go do it. Uh, but you can just search for Facebook Creator Studio and you'll find this link right here. Just go there. In my case, since I'm logged into Facebook in a tab, it's gonna open up and sign me right into the Creator Studio. And Creator Studio is amazing because you're able to post on Instagram from your desktop as well using the Creator Studio. But right now, let's look at how do you post to Facebook's pages stories. So when you log into your Facebook Creator Studio, if you don't have an account, do that, it's very, very easy. And it basically has two portions, Facebook and then also Instagram. So you're gonna go or stay at Facebook and then you're gonna click on this post right here. Create post, and this is a brand new button that just showed up for me just a couple of days ago. When you click on this, add story, and now you have to pick what page you wanna publish the story on. So for example, I'm gonna pick right here, the Ventura TV, that's one of the pages. So you have to be an admin of the page. So if it's your page, you're probably admin, or if you're your client's page, make sure you are the admin of that page. And then there are two options here. Create a photo story or create a text story, both of them, right? So uh, I can click on create a photo story and then uh, pick a, a photo from my desktop or my computer, or I can create a text story and let's actually just uh, type something here. You only carry the best brands on the market. And then you are able to look at that, pick different texts, font styles, and also different backgrounds. Look at that. Music. Oh my God, that's awesome. So, and I'm sure they just, they just launched this. I'm sure they're gonna probably improve this. So you're able to change your story privacy. They're probably gonna add a lot of new things here soon and I'll create more tutorial once I see like more things, more bells and whistles here. One thing I really want them to do is the same thing, being able to post stories on Instagram through Creator Studio. I think that would be very cool. So Facebook, if you're listening, you should do that, do that right now. Anyway, so when you are ready, just uh, click on this share to the story and your story will be posted. Now, let's go to that page and actually see that. So there you go, added story. So I'm gonna refresh this. And then go to the page. So let's go to that page and see if we can actually see that story on that page. See this ring? So I'm gonna refresh this. So this is the page where we published the story at or to. So when I click here, look at this. So we only carry the best brands on market. Very, very cool. So you're able to publish stories to your Facebook pages from desktop without using any tool. Used to be from, you, you, you had to log in and do it from your mobile, but now you can do it from desktop using the Facebook Creator Studio. And yes, fingers crossed, I hope, uh, Facebook launches this feature on Instagram as well. Right now on the Instagram side of things, inside Creator Studio, you're able to post to the Instagram feed and IGTV, but not to the stories or reels. So hopefully that feature is coming very soon. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, leave those questions below in the comments. Before you go, subscribe, hit the bell icon, and also like this video. I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.